All right, guys, before I get started here, I just want to give a little shout out to this restaurant chain here called Loving Hut, full vegan, and they're all over the world. They've got amazing Asian style food, fully vegan, ethical business. Check them out. There's probably one near you. Just Google them up. And now let's get started with another episode of Epic Vegan Meals. Because you know that I'm a vegan. I'm a vegan. I ain't eating no beef, no pork, no fish, no chicken. Now people think I'm tripping because I ain't eating no dairy, no eggs. But I stay well fed off the fruits and the veg cause. Boom. I care about the animals and the environment. I care about my health. If it ain't vegan, I ain't buying it. I care about the planet. If it does, then we go die with it. People hating veganism without even trying it. thinking, oh Joey, I'd love to cook all this vegan food. It takes too much time. I don't have the time. Well, have I got news for you. Now we got some of this. This is called Oomph. A lovely friend, uh, Camilla, uh, got this for me. Wanted me to try it. This looks like soya beans. I mean, we're gonna cook this up. Let's do it in real time. Let's hit it. Boom! Here we go, we got some mushrooms to see how fast we can chop them up. Boom! Alright, I got a bit of carrot down the center. Boom! Alright, we've got a pan on over here. Oh, we've got a pan on over here, it's scorching hot, so be careful. Maybe we'll put a pan on. Oh, that's really hot. Boom, veggies. Boom! Alright, we get the onions in first. Get the hard veggies in first. Here, we got that. Open it up. Boom! You know what? We want to do this quick, so just get it all in the pan. Crack a lid on there, get it steaming up. Now this here is my favourite herb. This is called coriander. Just chop it up, just get the nice skills happening. Oh, you just roll the wrist. Just roll the wrist. You're probably going to see me use a lot of these. These are my favourite vegetables at this moment. Peas. So we're going to chuck a few in. We've got to steam it up here. All right, to so all of you who are pressed for time, you don't have to use these. They do have plastic uh, packaging, but if you want convenience, just chuck one of these in the microwave, boom. All right, get the coriander in there right at the last minute for the herbs, always herbs at the last minute. All right, let's plate this bad boy up. A bit of the rice down, boom, ah, let, you know what, let's get adventurous, let's do all of it. Check this out. It's gone nice and crunchy, crispy, caramelized, chuck it on. Look at that. Just put a little cucumber salad on the side here, it's just chopped up with cucumbers. If you want, serve it with a bit of soy sauce. Not necessity, but what is a necessity is chopsticks, but I don't have any. I'm committing a cardinal sin here with the fork. But let's have a taste. Mmm. That's epic. Give it a try. It's juicy. Oh. a bit of shopping here. We get these uh, paper bags and we just like to reuse them. We've got our shopping bags over there next to Woodo and you know we try our best where we can. All right we understand some people just don't have time to cook something. We've got these Linda McCartney's country vegetarian pies suitable for vegans. Here we go we've got some of this V bites. I've been trying the V bites stuff. Southern fried chicken style pieces. Let's get these in, just heat up the oven, boom. There you go, it doesn't get more easy than that. Quick, easy, convenient, chuck it in the oven, put some veggies on the side. You want convenient? That's convenient. Vegan convenience food. Now, I forgot the piece de la resistance. This is the salad dressing, let's hit it. Whoa. Quick, easy, convenient, and tasty. You got no excuses. All right, everyone, hungry again, and I want to do something really quick, really easy, and really tasty. So I felt like tacos. Now I haven't had tacos since I've been vegan, but I thought I'd make them. I got the old 
El Do Paso taco mix. And I got some of this. Plant-based mints. This was in the, the butcher morgue section of the supermarket where they sell all the chopped up body parts of innocent animals. And they had this strategically placed near the minced up body parts. And it's 100% vegan and plant-based. So we're gonna try this. Boom. And we're gonna get this show on the road. Let's do it. Check this out. That is really weird. Really, really weird. All right. All right, so we're just gonna pop this in the pan. What you could do is, is caramelize some onions first, some peppers and all that stuff, but we don't have much vegetables and I want this to be quick. Let's do it. Yeah. So these little Old El Paso mixes come with these little seasoning mixes. We're gonna chuck that in. It's just a mix of spices. Come sprinkle. We'll add the sprinkle. Check that out. That's gonna be epic. Whoa, is that too much? I don't know. All right, we'll just chuck these in. Now we've got some of this Free From Mature Cheddar. This is my favorite brand, Free From. You get it in the UK. I don't know if you get it anywhere else, but this here's my favorite. Let's grate some up. There we go. Boom. Come up and get a close up of this. This is like really crispy and crunchy. We've got it. Let's just do a little taste test. Wow. Now that is weird. But tasty, really tasty. You know what, it's amazing we've got these plant-based alternatives that taste similar, look the same, you know, no cholesterol, no violence. You've got to make the ethical choice at the supermarket. Let's do it. All right, let's just whack some tomatoes in, boom. Stir them around. All right, everything's out of the oven and now it's time to assemble. Pretty simple, let's do it. All right, so this is pretty simple, guys. Just boom, just hit it, hit it hard. Hit them each with a bit of the plant-based meat. Hit them each with some cheese. Boom, vegan cheese, of course, no cruelty. Dairy industry harms animals like you wouldn't believe, so get the cruelty-free stuff. Fresh tomatoes. Okay, now we'll get a bit of carrot on there, boom. Then we got a little bit of the salsa at the end. Let's go. Check it out. Now, if that doesn't look like a pretty picture, I don't know what does. Took me about six minutes. If you get a little bit of vegan sour cream, you can hit that with a little bit of vegan sour cream. It'll be extra juicy. But we're just gonna do a little taste test and see how it compares to the ones I've had in the past. Let's go. Wow. Oh, have mercy. Look at that. It's amazing. All it was was one of these Stan and Stuff Eldo Paso kits. A bit of plant-based mints. Amazing. If you don't have plant-based mints, you can probably use some uh, savory uh, soya protein mints, the dried uh, dehydrated stuff. You could probably use some lentils if you don't like the mints, make it more whole foods. Boom, delicious. Try it. You know what? We're gonna hit it with a little bit of this. Just, just keep it secret, it's Laura's. Oh. <laughs> now, now it's the juice. Served with something refreshing, like a nice red sparkling wine. Non-alcoholic, of course. Gotta make a change. It's time for us as a people to start making some changes. Let's change the way we eat, let's change the way we live, and let's change the way we treat each other. You see, the old way wasn't working, so it's on us to do what we gotta do to survive. And still I see no changes.